Save money on back-to-school gear. Here is some advice on how to get the best discounts. It's the Senior Product Manager for PromotionalCodes.com. Please welcome Linka Keston. Linka, thank you very much for joining us here. Thank you. Okay, I mean, uh, the, the, the bottom line, how do you find great deals online? Well, you know, nowadays retailers are more than ever really competing for the consumer dollars, as we know, with the economy and everything. So all you have to do is really look for the promotional code to fill in the little box when you're checking out, and you can find deals for 20 to $200 off, 25% off. It's, there's just tons of deals out there. Whenever I'm checking out on any site and yeah. I see that little box and yeah. I don't have a code... You're missing out. I'm dying inside. <laughs> I'm dying a thousand deaths that I don't have a code for there. That's right. Okay, so what should I do? Well, it's pretty easy, actually. You go to, you know, there's different sites you can go to, like promotionalcodes.com or couponwinner.com, and just literally type in the name of the retailer. Or even better, if you're not quite decided where you're going to shop, you can kind of look through different categories to find the best coupon out there. What's the best thing to Google? I mean, the obviously, you, 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 yeah. you think your site's a great place oh, to go, no. but, mm -hmm. but do, I, do I get very specific? Do I do Definitely. gap pants codes, or what, what do I do? Well, if you already know what you're shopping for and you're at that checkout page, just look up, you know, Macy's promotional code or Amazon promotional code, and hopefully you'll find the best one to get you the most savings. Okay, so what sort of deals are out there now? Well, you know, I know back to school has been on, you know, a big right. topic that's, lately. that's why we have you here. So, yeah, we definitely see a lot of uh, retailers uh, coming out with some big discounts on apparel. So there's Macy's, Borders is offering, you know, you can get 20% off an item, uh, $30 off at Office Depot. Dell, actually, you know, you can buy directly for your laptops, $200 off with just punching that little code. So, By having that number that's or the right. number letter that's combination. A combination, exactly. Right. Why do they use codes? Why do they? That. Why not just give the discount to everyone or no one? Well, I think they like that kind of idea, that feeling that it's sort of a secret type of thing. If they uh, gave it to everyone, you know, they might also be losing out. Some some people don't need to use the codes, I guess, but for the most part, if you're uh, kind of savvy enough and know where to look, you can really find those. So codes. people like the idea that they're going out there and discovering mm -hmm. this code and using it to get the discount? Yeah, and I feel like I think the retailers are giving them that extra incentive to buy now and to use them over a competitor, and that savings feeling really makes you kind of even feel better about your purchase. Okay. Um, this economy, you seeing better deals? We are actually seeing better deals. It's an interesting time because of the competitiveness between the retailers. So I think more uh, retailers now than ever are starting to have codes that you wouldn't have seen a couple years ago. So, and you can definitely feel like, you know, don't shop without one. The retailers and e-tailers were so paranoid. They were doing back-to-school sales when we were still in school. Yeah. So what, when should you buy? I mean, we're coming down to the line now. We it's are now. Up, but yeah. is it time to buy or should you continue to wait? No, buy now, I think. But, you know, if you want to wait to the last minute, the retailers are still going to be competing. So, you know, there's never a bad time to look. Uh, but with free shipping online now, you know, you might as well order it a little bit ahead of time. Don't have to worry about going to the store and have it delivered to you for free. I would never pay for shipping. Right. <laughs> yeah, see, there you go. Um, scams. Uh, a lot of problems with scams? Um, there's some out there. You know, one thing I would never do, don't pay for codes. It's kind of a strange concept, but I've seen uh, places offering, you know, you can pay for coupons and have them delivered. They're, I've seen that. They're free. They're, you know, the whole point is to save money. So, you know, if you just look around, you'll be able to find them. It's, and there, you can even print coupons online now for the store. So you really shouldn't have to pay. That's one scam to avoid. Excellent. Thank you very much for joining us.